Uh, bad Batch. I don't know what else I need to say other than <laughs> go back to the last episode and watch us reacting to Cad Bane being alive. Um, I mean... God, I was so we kind of about knew this. he was going to be alive. Like we knew, we knew he was alive. We just didn't know said, he was going to be in it. It said at the end of the, it said that the original ending for the Clone Wars before it got cancelled was for Cad Bane to be killed by Boba Fett. Yeah, but it didn't happen. Well, happen. actually, it says now that he wasn't killed. He was shot in the head, but he wasn't killed. Which is he, like do. he'll take his hat off at some point and he'll have like a machine on his head. Mm. Um, but you know, we don't know that yet. Yeah, he um, took Omega. Yeah, he took Omega. Did you see the Did you see the meme where it was like new written bounty hunter better than Boba Fett and Cad Bane, and someone um, it's the memes again where it's, right. it's, it's Anakin on there go liar. <laughs> yeah. oh. Silly. I just yeah, and yeah, he shot Hunter. Silly. I don't think my heart ever dropped quite as much as when I thought Hunter was dead. <laughs> I thought he was dead. Because I was like, he, he was like, he's like the leader. He, I thought he is the mother. Yeah, I, I always assumed if they're all going to die, like you keep on saying they're going to, then I assumed Hunter would be one of the last ones because he's like the I saw a thing where it was like, figure. another meme where it was like, we all know what Filoni's going to do. And it was like, it was all of the bad batch standing there pointing the guns and then it was the, the hallway scene where Vader was standing there with his lightsaber. <laughs> God, I don't, oh. think I, could, I don't think I could take it. I don't think my <laughs> I, think I, I don't think it. my body could take it for one, for two reasons. One, I don't want all of them to die. Mm -hmm. Although I know they're all going to die, I, I don't want them all to die. And second, I don't think I can handle seeing Darth Vader <laughs> because I yeah. ugh, so it just does something to me seeing happy. All right, so this is episode nine. It's called Bounty Lost. Um, mm -hmm. We're gonna react. Let's see what it. Let's see what it. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I need to like mentally prepare mentally. myself. Because <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, though, I got I, it, that episode lured me into a false sense of security because I was like, oh, they, they've all had their inhibitor chips taken out, so I'm fine. And then there's and then Cad Bane comes in. I'm like, Whoa. I love that line that he did as well, where it was, once you've killed one, the rest are easy. <laughs> it's like, oh. Oh yeah, no, I forgot that. It, yeah. I just love how the animation looks. The only vessel in our scanners is oh, so smooth. Right on top of us. Don't let them get away. God, look at it. <laughs> you. You become. God, he looks <sighs> so like. You've become the very thing you swore to destroy. I just wonder why that. She's got to be so force sensitive. To get her back. She's got to be force sensitive. Like not even just like kill them all, get rid of them all, or whatever. It's like we want her back. Yeah. It's so like. That was the mission. Mhm. Mm it's her, wasn't it? Let me out of here. Real needed. Terminator. Oh! Oh no! What? She must be force sensitive. So it, the the want the DNA as well. So now it's like okay, it's there's something about her. He shot my leg off. He was protecting me. That's what friends do. Why isn't yours helping you? Oh, she's gonna manipulate him. Thing is, what's she gonna do if she does get out of it? They're on a ship in hyperspace. Send a signal. Find our communications device and send a signal. That is Seth Green. Is it? Sounds like him. Your description of the bounty hunter is a match for one from the Republic's files. Cad Bane. Cad Bane. He had multiple run-ins with the Jedi. Yeah, he did. Responsible for attempting to abduct Chancellor Palpatine. Yeah, he was. Bounty hunter on Pantora, not this guy. Exist. To my knowledge, there's only one other. Boba. Male clones, codenamed Alpha, later referred to as Boba. Ah! Since he disappeared at the start of the war, that makes so that's why they want the DNA because of Fett's raw genetic material. If she's vital to the Kaminoans' cloning operation, they must have put the bounty on her. So how do we find this bounty hunter? We go home. See if a contact zone. Plus maybe she's not far sensitive. Maybe it's just she's oh, she, she must just be. a regular. No, no but she, like she doesn't. It's she's not like Boba though. Yeah. There must be something else about her that's not just the fact that she's 
she doesn't have the yeah. growth thing that Bobber has. I mean, maybe there's something else that. Maybe even like the Minoans don't even know. Maybe it's just that one scientist. One knows. Huh? Do you know that scientist? The female scientist for the Quinoans? Yeah. Maybe it's something that just she knows about Omega. Mm. Which is why she's so desperate to get her back. You can't communicate in hyperspace? She's not in hyperspace anymore. That's impossible, even for a computer. <laughs> I do hope. It's a nice looking ship as well. I love his voice. Whoever voices him has got a mint voice. I love his look as well. Yeah. He looks like he's in a western. Omega? Omega, are you there? Omega! It's long range. I'll try to boost the thing. Oh my god! <laughs> Rip for can't pay get sir! Keep on running. Don't stop! <laughs> I mean, it's called Bounty Loss, so it, it must lose her. Mr. Bane, an unidentified ship is approaching. Check it out. Oh, whose ship? Well, it's going to be the Camino ones, isn't it? No. Yeah, but it said it was an unidentified ship. I told you you'd be sorry when my friend showed up. It's Fennec. It's Fennec trying to get the bounty is as it? well. It would make sense, wouldn't it? She's trying, they're both trying to get the same bounty, so they mm. Those sneaky bounty hunters. <gasps> oh. Oh. Yes! She's got the credits. This is so cool! He's holding a thermal detonator! Oh, there's all of his <gasps> credits. Oh, fuming! Run, Omega! Yeah, run! run. <laughs> I think it's thought, can we trust Fennec? No, of course we can't. Like, I don't know that's the thing, though. It's like... Turn around and... She seems to find a corner and hide. I'm absolutely convinced she's force sensitive. It's not just... It's not just the fact that she can... As Qui-Gon Jim would say, she can see things before they happen. That's what, a like Jedi with ability. Like with Crosshair when she said it wasn't, it's not going to be your fault when it happens. Yeah. Fail, don't think. Use your instincts. She absolutely... She must be force sensitive. They must have cloned a Jedi or something. Or taken something from the Jedi. Oh my god, please tell me it's not Snoke. It's not Snoke, <laughs> is it? Jeez. It might be, you know. What if the Kamino Owens are trying to create a body that Palpatine could live in if he died? And there, that's that's the connection to the sequels, because God knows Filoni's got to pull that out of the crap, I mean. <laughs> There's only one man who can pull the sequels out of the turd. Oh, I should get in it. Send a signal to them. Hang on. Oh, hurry up. Oh, your family's coming! Mom and dad and brother and sister, they're all coming! <sighs> I don't like that Mr. Bane thing. Wait till she's... Oh, that absolutely is! It's Snoke, isn't it? Oh, 
Must be. Oh, she has. Oh. oh, oh. I think it is. You know, it's either the. Oh, no, it's what it's it's. it's Camino it, looking, isn't it? Yeah. She has old Camino goo on her. I know she's got all <laughs> this sort of, sort of. God knows how long that's been there for. Embryonic fluid. I don't know if that's the correct way to say that word, but. If you'll excuse me, jump off. Everyone knows if you jump off a really high fight, but you say, if you'll excuse me first, you'll survive. Playtime's over. Oh. Feel, don't think. Usually, she's absolutely force sensitive. I think the Camino ones are trying to create a body that they can put force sensitive. That they can. That basically trying to create their own Jedi. Basically. Basically. Yeah. And it might be, it might be Palpatine. It might, he might have, you know, asked them to do it. It might have been Tarkin, acting on the orders of... No, but would she not have... I don't... This is so weird. This series has been a roller coaster of emotions like, innit? Never thought I would say that again. <laughs> Filoni just knows how to... Oh, she managed to escape. Go her. Yeah, Omega, you shouldn't Actually, need no saving. Actually, is that Camino? That looks more like Cloud City than Camino. <gasps> oh, Jeez. she just she just Randy Orton punted her. Did you see that? <laughs> That's the one that Randy Orton kicked Vince McMahon with. She's still up though. She's still going for it. No, she's cool, like, isn't she? But it makes it seem like she's working for someone else. Yeah. Because she was actually trying. Jeez. Oh my god, it's Star Lord. <laughs> Star Lord Bane, Star Lord Cad, Star Lord Bane. Yeah, it makes it seem like she's working for someone else. Yeah. She might not be, it might just be like a manipulation technique, like, but it. Oh, she's gonna, like, crash onto the. into the city. No, is she, is she caught in a. tractor beam? What is it? Is it. It's gonna be Wrecker. Be Wrecker. Omega. Oh ah! my god. Oh. oh, look at his big face. Right, let's not waste time. Get out of there. <laughs> yep, pack it up. Don't make me cry, Omega. Oh bless her, she's just you too pure. Are valuable to them. More than all the other clubs, even more than us. You're different. Different? How? She's damn force sensitive, I'm oh. telling you. I'm telling you she's force sensitive. Now, if that's true, I called that from back in episode <laughs> one. Sabotaged. Sabotaged. <laughs> uh. I feel like this series is going to have to... It's going to have to kill him, innit? Cad Bane's going to have to die in this. Meh. I require an update. Omega was oh, did she hire her separately? I can track them, but that will cost extra. No. As long as she is not in the hands of Lama Su, she is safe. I will transfer your payment. What? Okay. Okay. You know how to reach me. God, she really must... So she... She really, really likes Omega, then. She really, like... So she's got a different motive to Lama Su, who's the... <sighs> Prime... Yeah, jeez. what are it's you doing a, to there's me? There's obvious... There must be something more to Omega. She's Force-sensitive. She's got to be <sighs> Force-sensitive. Thing is, how many <laughs> chains of command can they climb before they get to Vader? thing is though like I was already getting so emotional when Omega was just crying when she saw them I don't, I don't know how I'm going to be able to handle anything else I nearly cried when I saw Rekka's face <laughs> just knowing that she was safe oh no I, know, I was, I was like, kind of expecting that little annoying droid to pop his head around I know that would have been that would have ruined my day <sighs> god I just I, oh, I can't it's I mad isn't it physically can't take 
the idea of anything happening to any of them. I know. So my standing theory now, right, is that she is force sensitive. She must be. There's so many hints that she is. Mm -hmm. It's not just the fact that it surely can't just be that they've got, they haven't She's got the accelerated growth thing. That can't be why they're interested in that because they can do that quite easily. But in orbit, she's got a first generation. Yeah, she's DNA. A, yeah, but I I think it's that she's force sensitive, and they're trying to create a clone that can that is force sensitive, essentially, so that they're creating their own version so of. So they the have Jedi. like their own like force sensitive troops. Either that, or it might be Palpatine trying to create a force sensitive clone for himself, so that he can, uh, which. It may very well lead us down the line of going, well, this is how Snow comes about. Because it wouldn't surprise me at all if Kathleen Kennedy's pulled Dave Filoni to the one side and gone, for goodness sake, help us. Help us. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, we don't Dave know Filoni what we're doing. Only hope. <laughs> yeah, make it all make sense. I feel please. like that's all this entire series is, is just us fanboying on Dave Filoni. Yeah. If I could sit in a room with, for one hour with Dave I Filoni, don't think I, I, would could, be happy. I don't think I could physically. I, I, <laughs> you would just be sitting there going, ah! I would just, Do you even know who you are? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel like that's just all Star Wars fans ever. Yeah, we just, love them. Just we love Dave Filoni. We love you, Dave Filoni. Never change. I just. Uh... Yeah, I'm still pr I'm still pretty sure they're all gonna die. Why did you you said that every single one of the episodes? Did because I, hate it? I feel like the entire point it's 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 like um, Rogue One in that the entire point of the film is to make you like these characters until the end when their deaths are really sad but really cool. I feel like they're all like so die. meaningful and yeah. so like, and they'll have more meaningful deaths than Kylo Ren. I wouldn't because we were talking about this and we didn't get this on camera. I want to talk about this, right? right? Which was the idea of the the Bad Batch being the reason why the Empire basically stops using clones. We did get that on camera. We no, but we didn't get all of it. And so, like, no. we talked about the idea that of them like taking some clones and t like getting their chips out. Not get, not necessarily get the chips out, but like because I mean they could, they basically with crosshairs they just kind of turned it up, didn't they? Yeah, turned and it up made to it more max, intense. Max yeah. Power. So what if they reverse that and like tech or someone made it so that they're just they're not active? Would be cool. And so that so the empire basically just turns around and they're like, well, yeah. clearly the easy to. Also, when crosshair get. was chasing them there, there was no mention of his squad at all. The squad wasn't there. Yeah. It was just him. I mean... He, he might turn on his squad. It's, he seems, like, almost desperate to get them, isn't it? It's, not. It's like, a lot more personal it's, than... Yeah, he's, he's past the threshold of good. Just, he looks so crazy with his, like, his bandage and his... I know. I think that's the classic Star Wars thing. You want to make a guy look super evil, make sure yeah. that he's had loads of injuries. Because yeah. they did it with Old Republic, where the guy had, like, half a face and bloody had one robotic arm. Yeah. I, th I feel like they know how to make a character look evil. And then there's just Anakin that gets melted. Yeah. And just, just Anakin yeah. loses all of his limbs. Mm -hmm. And he gets like French fried and yeah. Microwaved. <laughs> uh, yeah, so let's not ask what you think. Do you think she's force sensitive? Do you think we'll see Vader? Do you think. It would be cool if she was force sensitive. Do you think this will be, like Katie says, do you think it'll be the, the story of how, why they stop using the clones and why they move to Stormtroopers? It seems like that's what they're going down. When you think about it, they've already introduced crosshairs like squad who aren't clones. It seems yeah. like that's going to be the, the thing they go over for. Let us know down in the comments. Uh, then like the video, subscribe, ding the bell to be notified when we upload. We upload every day. We are now. Anything else you want to say? It hurts, doesn't it? It, it hurts. hurts to be happy. <laughs> yeah, it does hurt to be happy. It, do you know what it is, though? It's going to hurt even more when it gets sad. I, I just I don't, I don't I can't take it. I've already told the story about how I die when how I cried when ninety nine died in Clone Wars, and that was ninety nine and that was really early on. How do you think I'm going to handle this? What about did you not cry when the Jedi died saving the Twi'leks? Sean, yeah, sure, just right. Just All the classic. Take it, just take it as though I probably cried for most of the meaningful death. Do you know the okay. do you know the one I mean though? Yeah. When him and his squad. All his squad died and he was fighting by himself, but then his captain came over and was helping him and he died. I just, oh. And then he went, The Twi'leks will live to fight another day. And then he dies and he drops his lightsaber. And it's like, Oh. Just, yeah. 
uh, just take that I cry by most of the meaningful <laughs> deaths. That's but that. Uh. If you haven't getting, if you haven't getting right the way through five's story yet, you're not, you're not. I'm, you're not I'm ready. honestly scared too. You're not ready. Uh, yeah, like uh, no, what have I normally said then? Uh, You've already said, ask me what I, if I have. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. I need to know.